What's up guys? I'm Brandon from Paradise Vapor. And I'm Chris. We're going to do a patina for you today. <laughs> Alright guys, what we got coming up today is we have a AR Copper Mod. We're going, that does not work. We're going to patina. And we're going to try something new today. Using ground mustard. I haven't seen that done yet. We're going to try that out. So we've done quite a few mustards already. We've got several different style of tubes that we've practiced on and we've made one other video that we've had a lot of hits on and people have been blowing us up like crazy. So we're also going to be selling them through our store. So if y'all don't have the time to do them guys or just not getting what you're wanting out of them, hit us up on our page because you know it is what it is. People have been blowing us up for us. So we're gonna try to help everybody out. Blow it up! Our YouTube channel almost had 3,000 views in what six days? Yep. Cool, cool. Hopefully, we can keep passing this mustard trick on. We also got some, uh, let me get the vinegar. We also got some, uh, some vinegar we're going to try today. Um, but it's not your regular vinegar you find in your condiment section. This is actually vinegar that you clean with and uh, deodorizes, so they say. We're going to try that. Hopefully, it works. And then we also got some rock salt, stuff, <laughs> stuff you make with uh, ice cream. We're going to try that out too. So we're going to get this AR covered in mustard and uh, we'll get back to you here in just a few minutes. Alright, so we're back. We're finishing up the AR right now. Um, it's going to be pretty cool. I'm really excited how this is going to turn out. We're actually going to do the, the knobs on it covered with mustard and the insides are going to be blue. So we hope. Let's see if we can get this to where y'all can see it hard to see but like he said all we did is just hit all the high spots with the mustard because we're going to get our colors and everything down low so um, you know we're just going to try to go off of what we've done before and see what we can come up with um, every cool. one of them is different so yeah we'll, yeah we'll see what happens this time you know we'll be back all right guys uh, so all we've done is we've taken our ammonia bath uh, man that salt is it's stout. Uh, big chunks of rock salt. Uh, it's made for ice making ice cream, so it's bigger than regular rock salt. We laid it in the bath. It's all in the bath. Yeah, we put it all on the bottom. Normally we'd have mask on, but we can't talk through a mask where you can hear us. Um, put a lot of it on the bottom like we did with the sea salt last time. Um, put some ammonia in it and added a little bit more salt to it. Um, then we've got our sea salt and ammonia mix in our bottle. Made it really strong. Um, just gonna spray it down. Same thing as last time, guys. I pick it up so you can see it a little bit. Just don't change the, the uh, direction. Ready? See, you can see the uh, cotton balls hanging in it, like we always do. So it seems to be working well for us, and we do it in our bath also. So uh, all he's gonna do now is we're gonna start misting the mod. Uh, immediately, my mustard's turning orange. Um, and wear gloves. Because this ammonia hurts if you get cuts, guys. I'm gonna try to hold it so he can you can see it when he sprays it. Already turning orange. Oh god, dang it's strong. Wear a mask, everybody. Like I said, it's just hard to talk through. Uh, so it's already turning orange. We did it on the high spots just because we want to get our designs up there, and we're hoping to get colors and everything on the low spots. So uh, that's it. We'll put the cap on and then we'll get back with you in about 30 minutes. Uh, Chris has pulled out some, some vinegar, straight vinegar, and uh, he's uh, putting it on a mod right now. Vinaigrette. Vinaigrette, I'm sorry. It's all good. It's, apple, it's uh, an apple vinaigrette. I'm just playing with it. Uh, I didn't even know Brandon was about to hit record on this. So we'll see what happens with this. Um, I'm going to do the same thing I do on the others, put it above the ammonia bath and just. Just kind of just painting it on and just seeing what what will happen so we'll keep you posted we're back okay well here's what the AR is coming up and looking like Brandon's got another one going in here um, we're just playing with we're trying to do like a two or three stage patina on it and then I've got one going with the vinaigrette still so We'll keep y'all posted on those also. 
We'll see. We'll be right back. Pause. All right, guys, we're back. We got a happy camper here with his his AR mod. So did mustard like we said on the raised parts, um, which you know just to be clear is all these spots right here that are raised up. Um, did mustard there, uh, left the, the low spots bare where it's darker. Um, I like this, it added texture to it, which is really, it's, I know guys it's hard to see in the, the camera, um, but this ground mustard, again, it, it's pretty cool. It doesn't do the, uh, the patina itself, it's a mask, but the spots you get from it's really cool and the depth definitely, that it adds is definitely. really cool. I agree 100%. Um, and we got a couple others going, so um, we'll, we'll show you those when they're all finished up. But again, there's the AR. I think it came out great. Looks tough. Looks really good. So cool. uh, ready to get it all finished, dried up, so you can see him blast some clouds with it. We'll cool. get back with you. Crikey, we're we'll right back with you with the new patinas that we just finished today. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> trying to have a little fun, guys. <laughs> Anyways, this one right here I did with the vinaigrette. Got some cool colors with it. A lot it. of blues. Trying to keep the angle here where y'all can see everything, but so what we came out with on that one. This bloat here would be the two-stage patina that Brandon just finished today. <laughs> Rub Vaseline on the areas that you don't want to change. Put mustard back on the new areas. <laughs> Spray with ammonia and salt mixture, and leave it hanging above your bath. It looks really cool. I like that one. The stage, the stage is cool. A lot of fun. Anyway, and then, uh, here's, here's the, the, AR. the AR also. If you can, bloat came out looking right nice. If I do say so. Myself, can't do it. It's all good. You tried. Get it. You for effort. <laughs> so, anyways, guys. Hell yeah, that's what we did today. So, we'll try to make some more videos for you soon. Um, got some new mods coming. Uh, I've got an all copper Hades. I'm gonna do. I don't know, at least three or four stages on that. Uh, try to come out with some crazy depth for it. So, uh, and I'm gonna do the uh, Pegasus. Excited about that one. We got the Akuma coming. Got the Akuma coming, so that'll be fun. So, yeah. it's pretty fun. Oh, and a solid copper Maroxis. Uh, that one's gonna be neat. It's uh, gonna be a little different. Remember, we had a problem with uh, the Maroxis last time. Actually, we patined at the inner tube. And go grab it. Yeah, go we'll grab it. And when we patined it. Like, oh, yeah, we'll just put it back together and put the bat pop the battery in and just fire it up. No. For some reason, it's grounding somewhere because of the inner tube, for all we know. I think it's the outer layer. It was so. our first, one of our first patinas, too. But yeah. It's going to be a solid copper Maroxys, and we're going to do a total patina to it. So it'll be fun to try to have some crazy stuff going on with this. So we got a lot of cool toys coming that we're going to shoot some more videos. Uh, again, Thanks to everybody for, for all the shout outs and, and the questions and like Drew, appreciate page. you, man. Yeah. Drew from Florida, you're cool. Appreciate it. So um y'all check out his group, Sub Um Vapor Club. Uh, and also we've got condiment patinas. You can check us out on uh, Facebook and then our storefront, uh, Paradise Vapor in Lindell, Texas. You can check it out. And like we said in the beginning of the video, we'll be selling mods on there if uh some of y'all need some some mustard patinas or just custom patina work done for you. So, uh, yeah, I'm Chris. I'm Brandon. Y'all hit us up, guys. Later.